Hey guys, Cal Torak here. Today, I am starting a new devlog series about game development and my game Castle Warriors. I am an indie game developer, and I own my own studio called Cluck Games. It's a studio that I started with one of my best buds, Darbs. We are a two-man team, so that makes development fairly slow. We've been in early access for over a year now, and about six months ago we committed ourselves to a complete system rewrite of our game. When we started this project, we had no idea we would be working on it for more than two years. This project started from the idea that we would teach ourselves game development by recreating our favorite custom games from Warcraft 3 and Starcraft 2. After doing a few game jams, our plan for learning was to spend 30 days on a mini project by recreating one of these custom games. After 30 days, we would show the game to our friends and then move on to the next one. Except that never happened. The first custom game we decided to recreate was a game called Castle Fight in Warcraft 3, also called Nexus Wars in Starcraft 2. Very early on in our development though, we fell in love with the game we were making, and couldn't stop. What was once a 30 day project turned into a 2 month project, then a 6 month project, then our first official Steam release with the goal of releasing it in one year. Here we are well over one year later, and the game has changed dramatically since our initial conception. This is from something called Scope Creep, where every single new idea or feature for the game slowly pushes back our development timeline. This makes deadlines way harder to meet, and your expectations of how long something can take may end up being horribly wrong. This is one of our major massive mistakes we have made as a first time development team. We have dramatically underestimated the scope of each patch and the features we've wanted to add, which has led to our current situation. The reason for our rewrites was because every feature or change we added to the game was not intended in our initial design. As we added new ideas and systems to our game, it lagged our game more and more. Eventually, our game was just too laggy to handle the unit count on screen. We had to make a choice. Do we scale back the scope of our game and commit to our initial goal design? Or do we commit to this game for the long term and start our system rewrites? We decided to go with system rewrites because we truly love and enjoy our game, and we want to give it everything we think it deserves. We literally threw out all our old code and started a brand new project from scratch. While we wanted our massive system rewrites patch to be out before Christmas, clearly that wasn't possible. Here we are almost into May and we are still hard at work on these rewrites. We are getting close though, and that's what I'll be using this series for. Every Friday, I will be releasing a new devlog video on our game updating you guys on our progress and talking about the new systems we are adding. While I am doing this series to help spread awareness about the game, I am also doing this series for you guys. Three years ago I lost my job and had no idea what I was going to do next. Never did I expect to become a game developer, let alone own my own company. I hope I can use this series to show you guys the process and growing pains of being a new indie game developer and maybe inspire some of you to take your first step in that journey. If you are interested in Castle Warriors or learning about game development, give this video a like and subscribe. Take care everyone, and see you in the next update.